Today and tomorrow is a very crucial day. I'm Adam Alexi. We're at the end of term one, uh, second to last day of finals. Day one, they're learning how to hold a knife, but now they're actually cooking, putting down complete dishes that they've uh, created on their own. We're given rules that we had to make a menu over four days, and we're given certain rules, like we can't repeat techniques, um, and we're given the cuts of meat we have to work with. Dealing with all their own cooking techniques, starch, vegetable, protein, and sauce. It's kind of been like a game of Tetris, like which techniques fit in which, which vegetables and which cuts of meat. Criteria, it's all based on technique and the flavor of the food. Uh, presentation definitely plays into it, but we're still young on the presentation side. That's more just letting them play with the food. I, mean, I knew I was coming in to learn a lot. I didn't realize we are going to learn so much so fast. I really wanted to focus on time and sanitation and your attitude toward what you're working today, okay? Level uh, of confidence from 1 to 10, 10 being high confidence, what would you say? For, for today? today? Oh, number 10. For sure, we're gonna rock it out. All the best, let's start. Thanks. Thanks, Chef. Thanks, Chef. Thanks, Chef. What are you expecting out of your students today? Uh, outstanding. Very good. What do you guys want? Common mistakes uh, at this point. Uh, they get a stress out. If they don't have a good communication, everything falls apart. We have certain standards and we don't sacrifice that standard. These guys are making a curry paste from scratch. Within eight weeks, from holding knife, now I'm watching them cooking entire pieces, two plates, fine dining style, without any sacrificing my standard. There you go. I got a stuffed pork chop. I'm stuffing it with uh, um, basically like an apple with a, a cider vinegar, uh, sugar, cinnamon, and uh, panko. It's going to look pretty good, but this is definitely crunchy. Yeah, I'm nervous. Alright. Feeling good? Feeling rushed. Got a five minute? Do it, Jeff. So we score each individual item, the meat, the veg, the starch, the sauce. We also score whether they're on time or not, all their sanitation. It's a lot more work than I think we uh, thought it was going to be today. Nice looking. Nice looking. You, know, you did a good nice job stuffing. searing it first and then stuffing nice it. Nice fall. Really good. Stuffed chop. Oh yeah. Perfect. Moist. That's nice. Good. I didn't think I'd have this much kitchen time or this much experience with technique or knife skills, sharpening my knives, so yeah, I guess I'm definitely a lot farther along after two months than I thought I would be. I, I'm really proud of you guys. I had high expectations for the school and for, you know, the beginning class that it, it's lived up to it. I mean, it's phenomenal. I mean, like I said, they push you. It's well worth it. They work really hard and they, they put their heart and soul in this and I'm really proud of them.